Hello guys, welcome. Today we have some Star Wars Battlefront for you guys. Uh, this is survival of course. And let's get right into it. By the way, this was supposed to be live commentary but on my PlayStation settings since I changed the hard drive. Forgot to update it. I mean like choose your settings I believe, include microphone and clip. But so far I played after this, I played some drop zone. I'll probably request some drop song with some another member of the channel. So far I like it. I mean Star Wars. Of course. Like right now I was just trying to know what's up. So you see the three cards that they have each one has an action. Uh, for L1 is to change for my second area, which was a an iron torpedo, mostly for vehicles and shields. And R1 was the jump jetpack. And the triangle was for my special, in other words. I was trying to say how am I supposed to change from first to third person. So far, I started doing that, playing like changing from third to first, but I got mostly used to first. Probably too much battlefield. Too much dying light. Also. But so far, it's good. I mean, this is in survival mode, of course. Uh, oh, by the way, when you press the down button, when you hold it, you change the perspective. When you tap it, you change the left perspective when you're in the third person. Which is pretty, pretty awesome, maybe, really. So as you see, two hearts, little hearts on the top, uh, left corner. Those are my lights, so I can respond. This is really useful. Right there, I got my special. Now I can use it. And the progression of the waves, of course, the first waves are normal troopers, whatever. Then the second waves are harder, of course. The second is uh, heavy, the third one is the uh, same sniper, the fourth one jet troopers, then then all terrain scout trying to the uh, energy of these I don't know how it fits. And you see how I right now I use my shield. When there's no unit of bullets or laser or whatever you want to call it in this game. Basically yours. It, when it, once it gets overheated, you can set square when there was the two level two lines met the yellow in the curve. Uh so it's a special get on everyone. If you fail though you get like a penalty so it takes a lot of time. <laughs> that was not hard to <laughs> Okay, forget it that. If you fail when you do that to try to cool down your weapon, it gives you a time penalty. The so this is the first time I played and I liked it because once I played drop zone it was mostly oh it's like training I guess because in drop zone parts start coming down. See there's ATSD. Once the parts come down, you press for spare or whatever console or PC you're playing. That escape pod and will soon be ours. It will activate like you're on your side. Once it fills up the circle, it's yours and you get this special bonus. And drop zone is the same. So, but it's about you know how much you get and so on. So right there I took my, my proton torpedo. I was trying to aim it, but it's pretty pretty hard to be on the position. How you those things? But overall, I like it. It's really good. Right there, I was trying to, you know, I did something to the place that they go. I was like, throw it, I was like, oh, that's good. I was gonna do more damage, but no. Also, your main weapon, you mostly consist of a, of a rifle. If you're familiar with how it started from one and second one, you know you split classes. So, like, for example, assault troopers, and assault rifle, the engineer, and the shotgun, and the staffing, and the sniper. The uh, heavy or demolition, I don't know the name. Uh, had the mines and the rocket launcher. Here, rocket launcher, for example, is a special ability. I really didn't like that. Well, well. This, in my opinion, is mostly like a new, brand new overall top to bottom thing. So, right there, is, I, I see the real transition when you get to a certain analysis. I don't like that either, I mean, I don't know how that works, will work, and I haven't tried the uh, soul water in stock, but I hope it doesn't really, I mean, I don't know, I'm trying to do it. 
So, so far, there's the as you can see, so, so, well, in terms of you pre-ordering it, I will say, it all depends, for example, I like Tower Shatterstone, the second one, the first one I liked it more, if you played it on the PlayStation 2, or I don't know if it came for Xbox, if it came, I'm sorry, but for example, Red from 1, I would play it casually, because, the, in my opinion, the AI was more stupid, therefore it was more fun to play. Rower would cluster in little tunnels with those RPG and stuff. But from 2, the AI got more, more smart, but it's smarter, but um, it's not like a challenge, depending on what the difficulty is. Well, not really a challenge, but it's fun also. So there I did a little transition. I got a call, so I had to answer it way not. So yeah, pretty much. I mean, in terms of high provider, as I told you, but it depends. It really depends how you feel about it. <laughs> wow, the audio is off in here. Damn. Sorry about that, guys. Air courtesy from the PlayStation 4, as I told you before. Not so reliable. It was weird. I was playing it, and the the freaking fan of the PS4 was like, well, to take off and get through my window and start flying away. But I mean, is there? This is survival. There's only six. Uh, what's it called? Six waves. You could finish this in less than ten minutes. So it's a little, a good quick play. Now, when it comes to drop some, when we upload it, I played it before. I already played it. That one it depends. Because, uh, look at this, look at those guys, just yeah, people going, look, oh man. Uh, I do like the graphics, but I don't know what engine they're using, but it's there, it's like a nice. But so far it's good, I mean, it's the beta, I know. I also played the Rainbow Six Siege beta, I know it's in the channel, but I don't know, for that one, I wouldn't, I wouldn't play it. I don't, in, for my case, it doesn't have a replay value because you have to rely on your teammate. Which is the whole point and all the game. But for the whole this one, you would like to buy it for your kid or for your somebody, for yourself or anybody you know, family that loves Star Wars. I will, I will say yes because also it has split screen in here in survival mode. You can either split screen is local or you can co-op online. But the thing is that there's no such sort of matchmaking. You have to invite your friend. To the part to your party in the PlayStation 4 or 8 spots and so on, and then it, you can actually play co op here, survival. Uh, and so far, with what I saw, there's gonna be half survival, ender survival. Uh, I don't remember, I don't remember the other ones. Now, see, those guys have a shield, but once the shield's down, they're dead. <laughs> it's pretty cool. So, yeah, I mean, I, I enjoyed the game when I was playing it, uh, of course. It all depends on what type of gamer you are. I used to be a hardcore, like, not hardcore, I don't know, but like, I would stay hours playing, I guess I, I would just say regular. But then I, I don't know, right now I just play like, let me see, like, about an hour. And then I got, I got tired. So I'm just, I'm just talking to you, people. So there's the ATSD. Oh, uh, the ATSD, I got my shield there. They're hard. Well, I mean, it's a freaking big cool <laughs> that guy trying to oh by the way when you try to capture the pot and you're in survival if you don't not, not near it or something they can capture it back so yeah be careful about that so there I'm just shooting 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 like whatever so there like I press the wrong at the wrong time the little lines that show up and they give me a penalty so it takes a lot more time to cool down I, like this, this is my theory. I don't. I'm not like a hard hardcore fan of Star Wars. Like I know there's people that know how like, there's books of how supposedly these machines work. Can you leave? Can you leave in the comments below? How does does, does, there, does that weapon have a nuclear thing? Oh well. Well, hope you enjoy the video. I'm out. Thank you.